Great. So Anurag, are you there? I'm here, Vinit. Yes. Would you like again 10 second version of your question? What does it mean? Uh, uh, sure. So basically, uh, I'm referring to one of the scenario wherein multiple agile teams, uh, roughly about uh, 40, 50 agile teams uh, were working together, but there was no standardization of practices, right? They were not using any scaling framework. Basically, Scrum was used by most of the teams, right? But the practices followed were different. They had different set of tools. So uh, understanding their outcome productivity was very difficult, right? So that's the question all about. Uh, how do we bring in a common set of practices from Scrum across uh, the multiple uh, set of Agile teams? Well, thank you so much, Anurag, for sharing this uh, challenge. Uh, I would like to invite you all to think about responses. Same thing, raise your hand. Maybe for one of the things, we'll do a breakout session also. But I would just like to ask a question to you all. Is agility really about standardizing? Standardizing practices across teams or organization? That is the first line of the Agile Manifesto. Why do you have to standardize? Are all teams same? Are they all working on the same work? Are we manufacturing units? Okay. Manufacturing unit in Noida has 20 machines. Exactly copy paste and set up a similar unit in Pune. Isn't it? Agility. That is one thing that I would like to rather leave you with this question. Is agility really about standardizing across the organization? While I gave you this hint, I would like to invite you all for any specific response to Anurag's question. How would you standardize your scrum practices across mm -hmm. multiple teams? That's the whole point of this question. And yes. one more thing that I realized at the end is how do you track? How do you maybe compare and all of that, right? I heard something at the end you said, right? How do you track work of the team? Something like that. Anyone feel free. You are absolutely encouraged mm -hmm. to have a view or a counter view. Maybe I'll nominate somebody now. What do you say to share? Yeah, <coughs> Yeah, yeah, maybe uh, I, I can take it. Uh, and who no, is that? Uh, I'll please raise your hand first so that we can give priorities to everyone. Okay, who is trying? Yeah. Uh, put it. I encourage everyone to use this opportunity to share. Let's contribute. That is the only way to grow in life today. Contribution and service. Nothing else. Okay, so please come forward. While I invite Puneet to share. Yeah, Puneet, short version. Uh, yeah, basic uh, concept that I think of agility is uh, we need to get the work done and uh, the output outcome should be valuable to the customer. So it, it does not have any right way or wrong way. The teams can have their different, uh, no need of standardization. The teams can have their, uh, their own version of, uh, of providing output to the client. Whatever works for them is the right practice for them are you saying let's customize scrum based on the teams are you saying no, that uh, no. i'm saying that uh, apart from the basic uh, four or five events of scrum and the basic uh, things of scrum we teams are uh, free to work any way they want i think yeah well great point Puneet. i think you have nailed it down already let's not go further here this is very clear uh Puneet, thank you so much this is exactly what i'm saying uh Let's not confuse ourselves too much. Things are very simple. It's like rule book of cricket, right? You know, cricket or football or any other sport for that matter. The rule book applies to all the teams as they play the game professionally. Yes or no? Is the rule of cricket different for Australian cricket team? Is it different for Pune or the rule book is the same? Yes, it's the, it's the same. same. But same. their approach to the game is different. Maybe Australians are very aggressive. Maybe Zimbabwe has their own way. Currently, they are just trying to save themselves and survive in international cricket. I think that is the message uh, we have here. That while you play the game within the set of rules, you can add your own practices the way it suits you to deliver value to the customer. Have I summarized your point, Anur uh, Anurag? Does that help? Yes, ma'am. Yeah. yeah that makes so this sense. is a question your organization will to ask. Your leaders have to set your Coaches have to talk about it. Why do you want to standardize? Because teams are unique. They all solve unique problems. One practice will not. That's why in Scrum or Agile, we say emerging practices, right? There is no yeah. best practice. There are only emerging practices. Something which worked for Tushar's team might not work for Kushbu's team, might not work for Shantanu's team, might not work for Manjunath's team. Isn't yeah. it? Yeah. 
yeah so you have to figure that out but still play the game within the rules yeah. i think this is a clear one let's not confuse ourselves uh, anurag if you are satisfied with the response with your permission may you. i move it to done yes please thank you okay